This Javelin flow is an example of how to copy a table from an Oracle database to an MS SQL database table. Now what we're going to do is we're going to use the data reader action in Javelin and the SQL bulk copy action. And this will allow us to copy a table from an Oracle database to an MS SQL database. And so we move to Data Maker and you see in this source window here that we're connected to an Oracle schema. And in fact, our source table is this address table. And so we're going to have a look inside of this. And so there are in fact 61 rows in this uh, Oracle table. And if we look in the target window here, we are connected to a SQL Server database. And in this database, we have our target table, which is this address table. And if we query the rows in this table, you'll see that there's no rows returned. So this is an empty table. And so now we move on to Javelin. And here is our Javelin flow. And you'll notice on the canvas that we have this data reader activity action. And this can be created from here. And what this allows us to do is to query a database and return our query into an iData reader object. And later on, we can then reuse this object to read into a, a, another database. But for now, let's look at the configuration of this action. And because we're reading into an Oracle database, we need to, or reading from an Oracle database rather, we need a to give a service name. And so I've given the service name here. We need to give a server. You give a schema. You also give a username, which in the case of Oracle, I think are usually the same. And you also insert the query here. So it's this select statement. So I'm selecting the whole address table. And you need to put in the provider, of course, which is Oracle in this case. You give the password for that username. And then also as well, you need to define some uh, I data reader object, uh, which is which has been defined in the variables pane here, this I uh, out data reader. And if we enter the scope of this action, You'll see now that we have uh, another action, which is this SQL bulk copy activity. And so this uh, I data reader object that we've read our query into, we now use this as an input parameter for this SQL bulk copy activity action here, which can be created there. And so we use this as an input parameter to read into our database table. And again, for this uh, action, there are a number of property values that we need to define. And so we need to give the username for this uh, database. We need to give the server, which is, I've used a variable here, SQL server name. So it's just this uh, local host server here. And you also need to give a password. And again, this data reader object is this out data reader object, the same one that we use for this activity. And of course, you need to give the da database name and the table name. And so now if we uh, run this Javelin flow, we should find that uh, we've copied our table over to the target database. And so we save the changes before the run. And you'll see that we've executed uh, successfully and the flow has quit. And so uh, if we go back to our data maker window and we uh, run this uh, query again so we query, query all rows and you'll see now that we've actually uh, found well we've moved our data from the source to the target 